What's going on guys? Welcome back to another low cap gem video where I'm going to be sharing a few low cap oats that I feel could absolutely blow and potentially change your life. Now, one thing that won't change your life is following me on Twitter. However, I'm pretty active there daily and I do speak a lot about things that I'm doing, crypto, property, and all that sort of stuff as well. And if you're not following me on Twitter or even on Twitter, when it comes to finding low cap gems, you're what the industry would describe as NGMI. You're not gonna make it. So guys, I want you to make it. I need you to make it. So get yourself a Twitter account and of course, follow this guy's account. So anyways, before we begin, I want you guys to drop me your favorite crypto in the comments down below. It can be anything, even if it's Dogecoin. I won't laugh. So let's kick it off with today's first alt, which is Bab, whose ticker is Bax, which at the time of recording, this has a disgustingly low market cap of 21.1 million. And as you can see from the charts here, when it rips, it definitely rips. Now, one thing with the small caps is their volatility is unreal. It doesn't take much to really move them in this market. But here's three reasons I think you should be doing some more research on BAB and why I think it's worth it. So firstly, the technology. BAB has created is focused around the financial services, where their goal is to make basic financial services accessible to everyone. Now, what's cool about this BAB app is that it allows people to store and manage their assets, as well as fundraise and donate to causes all over the world. It's a one-stop shop essentially. Plus, it's been seen and featured in the BBC News and the Forbes and other media outlets as well. Next up, another positive one is it allows you to cut out the middleman and avoid unnecessary fees. So you can essentially send and receive multiple currencies to any BAB user across the world at the palm of your hands. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing an ad for them right now. I'm not sponsored guys, but I am invested for full transparency. And the most exciting point about this is how much potential it has from a price perspective. Because let's be honest, you guys only care about making money, right? It won't take much to make this a potential 100x or maybe even long term if it gets the mass adoption that I believe it could potentially get a thousand x gem imagine that putting 500 pounds into this to one day have 50 000 pounds back that's not too bad is it but moving on my friends next up we have jasmine at a price of 0.03 dollars at the time of recording this and a market cap of 147 million guys it almost looks to me like a sleeping giant and i can just see it ripping if we continue the bullish momentum we've been seeing over the past few weeks and bitcoin does its thing towards all time highs. So let's check out three reasons why I believe Jasmine may be one to defer the research on. Now, Jasmine was started in my favorite city in the world. That's not a reason, by the way. Tokyo. But Tokyo is awesome, guys. And the first positive is the team behind it. We have the former CEOs from Sony and a former president and COO not even sure what that is, but it sounds important, of the Sony Corporation 2 working on this. Alongside this, Jasmine's technology is focused around supporting data democracy. And in simple terms, friends, it aims to return personal data to the hands of the individual and ensure it's managed and distributed in a secure way, which in today's world, I'm all for it. And finally, the third positive, again, similar to Bab, the price action hasn't ever started at least in my humble opinion. I'm not joking when I say this could make serious moves. Most people on YouTube and Twitter are shouting the $1 mark, which seems a more long-term projection, but its all-time high was $4.99. But as with lower cap alts, when Bitcoin decides to turn bearish, these literally melt downwards. Again, guys, high risk, very high reward. And finally, my friends, one of my favorite ones, Trias. One of my favorite projects I got into ages ago that has just started waking up recently. But again, my friends, this is a high risk, high reward as well, with a market cap of 9.8 million. As of recording this, it's a little baby. But what makes Trias a worthwhile project to research? Well, let me tell you in simple terms, because if you go on their website, you're gonna see some very, very long words like a fully stacked, decentralized, trusted cloud infrastructure ecosystem blah, blah, blah. However, TRIAS, which is an acronym, I believe for trustworthy, reliable, intelligent, autonomous systems is a very ambitious blockchain project that aims to improve scalability and security and is a cloud computing based infrastructure. It is a layer one blockchain that can also support public blockchains like your Ethereum's out there. And if we look at some of the technical data behind TRIAS and compare it to other projects like your Cadenas and your DAGs, it has less circulating supply can utilize any form of data, safer from an attack perspective and has a faster transactions per second compared to some of its competitors too. Now, price targets in the future, if this runs, I can see it easily hitting $50 mark, almost a 10x from your current price right now. But I believe it's gonna 
dwarf that. Now, if I haven't frazzled your brains, friends, and you find these types of videos useful, I'd be really grateful if you could smash up that like button. So until next time, my friends, I just want to take this moment to thank you when you couldn't be doing anything, but you chose to spend a few moments with me. And that makes you pretty awesome. So until next time, my friends, thanks for watching.